Uh, we are here for an exciting moment as we hold our second schools contest in insurance for secondary schools. Uh, if you recall, last year we organized the very first contest where we had about 20, about 20 schools participating, 28 schools participating. And the main objective of the contest is to bring insurance to the lower levels or to the young generation. And uh, why? Because, one, we've realized that uh, in order for us to build trust in insurance, we must start with the young generation so that they grow up knowing insurance, understanding insurance. We believe when they become decision makers, then they will be able to have a soft spot for insurance. Two, we also wanted to encourage young people to embrace insurance as a profession while they are still young. Initially, we would go to schools and ask them, ask young people what they would want to be. You would hardly hear insurance as one of the career options. Today, I'm happy that when you go to schools, now insurance is a household name. Today, we have about 40 schools that are contesting this time around, and the level of insurance knowledge exhibited by the schools is very high. When you hear students answering insurance questions, you may think they're actually insurance professionals. Now, this gives us hope that the students that are coming from secondary schools will be able to carry on the insurance work from the level where we are to the next level. We are happy that uh, we've worked with the different schools and uh, we've had now a higher number of schools participating. And probably next year, we should be able to involve other schools in other regions so that we make it grandy. I've seen brains at work. I've seen people seriously being creative. I see Ugandans who are going to be problem solvers. You know, we have many problems out there. And they have remained to be, they have continued to be problems because many, majority of Ugandans do not have that skill to solve problems, to creatively think and come up with solutions. 